This is the first look at macOS Tahoe, Apple's biggest release ever for Mac. It brings a major UI redesign, lots of bug fixes, and better performance. At the time of recording this video, Mac OS Tahoe is available as a developer beta. Now let's go over the new features of Mac OS Tahoe version 26. Liquid glass is a new design style for Mac OS. It adds a transparent glass-like look to the interface across Apple devices. Now, user interface elements in Mac OS like tab bars, buttons, sliders, and menus have a soft, glassy appearance. They reflect and react to what's behind them in real time, making everything look clear and more natural. Now, these elements also respond smoothly to your actions with fluid animations and transitions that feel like moving liquid. This design is used across all Apple devices. Also, the dock, applications, widgets on the home screen, and the brand new control center follow this new design language. In macOS Tahoe, the menu bar is now transparent, making your display feel larger and more open. The new control center has been completely redesigned with the liquid glass look. It feels smooth and natural when using the sliders and buttons. You can customize it just like on your iPhone. Simply click Edit Controls and you will see a panel where you can easily add or remove controls. Now, this is the best control center experience on Mac since macOS Big Sur. Mac OS Tahoe gives you more control to personalize your Mac than ever before. You can now customize folders in Finder. Just right-click a folder, choose File from the menu bar, Customize Folder, and change its color or add an emoji for a personal touch. Also, under System Settings, Appearance, you can change the style of app icons and widgets. For example, the tinted style picks colors from your wallpaper and applies them to icons, the dock, widgets, and spotlight. You can even choose your own color from a palette or go crazy with the clear icon style which looks absolutely stunning. Spotlight Search and Launchpad are now redesigned for a faster and smarter browsing experience. You can quickly find applications, files, clipboard history, and even get suggestions based on what you do regularly. The Launchpad icon in the dock now gives you access to all your installed applications. And with iPhone mirroring, you can even launch applications that are only installed on your iPhone. One of the coolest updates is App Actions. You can now do tasks like create calendar events, start recordings, or send emails directly from Spotlight, so no need to open the applications. Now, my favorite feature is parameter filling. For example, you can send an email by choosing Send Email, then just type your message, Set the recipient and subject all without launching the mail application.
and with clipboard history you can view everything you have copied recently making it super handy for multitasking Now continuity is what lets Apple devices work together smoothly and now it's even better. With macOS Tahoe, live activities now appear on your Mac too. So if you order food on your iPhone, you will see a live update in your Mac's menu bar. Click it and it opens the application using iPhone mirroring, letting you take action directly from your Mac. Another big addition is the phone application on Mac. You can now view your synced contacts and make or receive calls right from your Mac. Incoming calls show up with contact posters, just like on iOS 26. The Mac version of the phone application also includes features like hold assist, call screening, live translation, color ID, a keypad, and much more. And that's pretty much it. This is the quick look at macOS Tahoe and its big features. Let me know what do you think about this in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching. This has been KS Kiroyo. I will see you in the next one.